What is going on, champions of the world? Welcome back to the channel. The drift has ended, or has it? Are we going to see any more surprises within the next week or at Battleground? I don't know. We shall see. But the commentary, the announcers have been getting switched up, brought up, leaving. So let's talk about it. We got WWE commentary gets a facelift for the new era, and we got a picture of Corey Graves there. He's getting moved up to the main roster. He'll be calling the shots. So let's just go here. All right, here we go. The new announced teams for Monday Night Raw will feature Michael Cole, who was always doing Monday Night Raw, uh, Corey Graves, who was doing like the pre-shows and NXT. He is now going to be doing Monday Night Raw, calling the shots there. And Byron Saxton, who was doing Monday Night Raw. Um, so yeah, so looks like JBL is not on Monday Night Raw anymore. And uh, JBL's move over to SmackDown. Alright, let's do SmackDown now. Mauro Ranello will be calling SmackDown. JBL has moved to SmackDown. And David Otunga will handle the commentary for SmackDown Live. Where is the king? Where is Jerry Lawler? Lawler has been dropped. And I'm trying to check on his Twitter to see if there is any statement. Um, no statement. As of a day ago, he just put, he retweeted something. But there is no statement from Jerry the King Lawler. He's not going to be on Raw or SmackDown. It looks like David Otunga maybe is taking his place. JBL has moved from one brand to the other, so it'll be, it'll be interesting to see how, how JBL and Moro commentate together. Um, I'm excited to hear Corey Graves on Monday Night Raw. Really, really super exciting. Um, I, he's gonna be, I guess, playing playing the heel. He'll be the heel probably on Monday Night Raw, and JBL will be the heel on on SmackDown. But yeah, I mean, we'll, we'll see. We'll we'll see how next week plays out. We got a full week next week of uh, of the split of Monday split and Tuesday split, and see how everything works well together. I'm excited to see it. I mean, now that after having like a night's sleep and just looking at Raw. And SmackDown, I'm okay with it. I mean, I know you can't satisfy everybody. Somebody's going to have a problem with it. But I'm okay with it. If I could have made two changes, I would have liked to see um, Cesaro on SmackDown. And and Zone Cast on SmackDown. And then I would have been super, super happy with it. But I don't know. You can't. It's fine with me. I think, I think it'll be fine. I, I can't wait to see how Battleground plays out this weekend. Um... I'm, I'm a little salty and sour that <laughs> Bailey didn't get um, pushed up to the main roster, but I was reading online a lot of rumors that maybe she will on Sunday, perhaps, be uh, Sasha Banks' mystery opponent. That would be totally cool with me. But yeah, I'm still talking about the draft. I'm still excited about it. Um, I'm interested to read your comments down below and see what you guys thought about it. And uh, let me know what you think about the announcers, the new announce team. And what's up, WWE? I'm still here. I'm waiting. You want to you wanna call up the luge to be on the announce team? I'm ready to represent. I'm ready to call the shots. You just, you just, you just, you just let me know. I'll be, I'll be waiting right here. You know where to find me. YouTube slash LugiPS3 or at LugiMania on Twitter. Hit me up. I'm, I'm, I'll be waiting. <laughs> Anyways, champs, um, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.